three of our 20 minute movement for 20 day series. So 18 days away till my wedding. So this is the third day and each day so far we've done a lot of poses on the ground, kind of just trying to bring everything down. But today we're gonna stay in this kind of middle center area. We're gonna do a lot of twists, a lot of heart openers. So get something comfortable and come and meet me on your mat. Let's inhale, reach our arms up towards the sky. Let the thumbs connect and then push the walls away from you as you bring the arms down by your side. Inhale, reach the arms, palms up. Allow them to connect at the top. Gaze forward and see if you can reach your arms up a little higher. And then exhale, push the walls away as the fingertips connect to the earth. Good, three more. to come together in heart center. Close your eyes. Notice why you came to your mat today. What is it that you would like to appreciate today? reach the arms up, stretch up. Exhale, release the right hand down, side bend towards the right. And then inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, release left hand down, side bend. Inhale, reach all the way up, stretch up. Hands come down through heart center. And then slowly we'll come into an all fours position. Feel free to pat up your knees a little for a little bit more comfort. And then from here, slowly coming into your child's pose, reach the arms long. Head connects to the earth. Let's take three breaths here. Slowly gliding up, hands to the thighs. Inhale, reach, lift up onto the knees, stretch the arms up. Exhale, twist towards right. Inhale, lift. Exhale, twist. Inhale, lift. Exhale, twist. A few more like this, breath in. And out. Breath in and out. Another breath in, reach up. And release the hands down, tuck the toes under, lift the bottom, lift the chest up. Exhale, round, push through and bring those hips all the way back towards the heels. Inhale, roll yourself forward, lifting up, opening up the chest. And exhale, rounding and pulling your spine back towards your heels. Lifting back up onto the knees, stretching the arms up. Hands come behind you, or maybe just down by your sides. Clench your fists. And then take those fists 
into your side body. So really just kind of push the, hip, the fist into the hips so that it really stands you up nice and tall. Imagine you're going down like a water slide and you're holding everything in. The strength is coming from within. You're lifting through your chest. Maybe that's lifting you up a little bit more. Trying to promote this extension in your spine. And then inhale, bring the hands together in heart center. Exhale here. And then nice and slow, we're gonna bring our hands to our hips and then just shift the weight side to side. Maybe tuck the toes or untuck. And then we're gonna slowly lean the body over towards the left as you lift the right foot coming forward. You might need to help it out a bit for it to get up there. And then slowly just rocking forward and back, maybe lifting up those toes, maybe releasing the back toes. And then coming forward, inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, bring them down to frame that front foot or use blocks, lift your chest up high. Exhale, walk the blocks or your hands back so you lift the front toes. Maybe check in with which setting feels better for the blocks. Maybe you come all the way down or you're up nice and high, lifting your chest. Soften your face and close your eyes for a moment. And then for our last moment here, just shift your hips kind of side to side and notice you kind of point and pull that right foot forward, the right hip comes forward and see if you can pull that right hip back and just kind of play around with just shifting side to side and then drop that foot down, frame the front foot, tuck the back toes, lift the back knee up, find your strength, your balance, gaze down at that right big toe for a moment, maybe lift up the toes and then plant them back down. And then feel the lower belly kind of pull up as you feel strength kind of pulling you up from the center. And then inhale, lift all the way up, reach your arms up, Breathe in here, lift. Exhale, hands come down to heart center. It's okay if you need to bring that foot in more, if you need to bring that knee a little bit over the ankle a little bit more, but just find a strong position, breathe in. Exhale, release the arms by your sides as you tilt your front forward. So your heart is coming towards the earth, the arms behind you. And then inhale, pull yourself up. Start to straighten that front leg as you lift the arms. Exhale, bend through the knee as you guide your arms, your triceps, lift up towards the sky as your heart lifts. One more, breathe in. And out. Inhale, lift the arms up. Exhale, hands come down to heart center as you lean forward, bring that left foot forward, connected to the right. Inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, arms by your sides. Make those tight fists as you push the palm side into your this legs. A new way to bring heavy metal to some heavy metal music. Feel the connection, drag down through the feet, lift through the top of your head, feel the strength in your own body, and then bend through the knees, inhale, lift the arms up as you extend, exhale, slowly bend the knees, widen the feet here as you open up the hips and slowly hinge forward, surrendering over your legs. Just letting the head shake yes, shake no. Whew. 
And then slowly rising all the way up, you can do this. Lift your heart, lift your arms. Exhale, release the arms down by your sides and then pull them back to interlace behind you. See if you can bring your thumb knuckles right to your bottom and then pull the knuckles down as you lift through the heart. So just try to pull them down versus out. Just pull down so you find the pulling down of the chest and then release the arms give yourself a big hug breathe in and out and then inhale sweep the arms up exhale release the hands down all the way down to blocks or to the earth slowly coming onto one knee and then the other opening up the knees, sinking down into a child's pose, release head to earth. Inhale, I choose. Exhale to let it go. Inhale, I choose. Exhale to let it go. And then lifting back up, inhale, I am. Exhale, strong. Inhale, I am. Exhale, beautiful. Inhale, I am. Exhale, full of love joy and happiness and then rise up with that intention just allow that energy to come up through your body lifting up through the crown to the universe above breathe in exhale hands come down to heart center and find your hips again to find a little bit of swaying side to side And then when you've kind of gotten a feeling for each side, we'll slowly shift our weight over towards the right as you bring that left foot forward. If it takes a couple of tries or if it takes that assist from that other hand, that's okay. And then just place the hands in the hips and then just find some movement, some opening through the knees, through the hips, through the toes, through the feet. And then coming forward, inhale, lifting the arms up, exhale, as you bring the arms back, you're going to straighten through that left leg, inhale, lifting up, exhale, breathe in, exhale, and grab a hold of the blocks. Allow them to frame that left leg and then lift the left toes. Find the lift in the heart, the extension through the neck and the spine. Breathe in. You can slowly start to bring those blocks on a lower setting. Slowly coming forward, bringing the blocks in front of you, tucking the back toe, lifting the back knee, feeling the strength in that front leg, knee over the ankle. Breathe in and out. And then breathe in. And exhale, feel a little bit like pulling in as it lifts you up, up, up. Lift the arms up. Feel free to adjust the feet to maybe bring that foot in a little closer so you feel a bit more steady. 
make sure that front knee isn't coming too far in and that you can see your big left toe. Breathe in here. And then exhale as you come forward, you're gonna bring the arms back. Triceps guide up towards the sky. And then as you inhale, you're gonna straighten through that leg, lift the arms, straighten both legs. Exhale, bending through. Two more, breathe in. And out. Breathe in. And out. And then hands to the blocks. And then you're gonna bring the blocks to center of your mat so that you have a wide legged forward fold. And just allow yourself to release Breathing in and out. And then slowly start to bring the feet together. As you sink down, maybe using those blocks to come underneath your bottom, or you can come all the way down. Hands to the inner thighs, lift through the heart. And then remove the blocks slowly come to a seat, make it a comfortable seat, close your eyes and let your body just be here, notice any sensations that are flowing through your body. what your body needs. Notice if it's giving you any sensations or, or feelings that you have had before. And then place the hands into heart center. And if you'd like, you can end practice here and have a wonderful rest of your day or your night. Or if you'd like to stay with me to do some abdominal limb drainage, you can stay. So thank you so much for joining. For those of you who are going to stay, we'll come down into a lying down position. If you can, grab something underneath your knees. I like to get comfortable so you can grab a blanket to put over you and then just settle your upper body down to the earth maybe make any little adjustments like if you want to stretch the arms up for a moment just to lengthen your spine and then just place your hands to your lower belly Feel yourself breathing here. And then I'm gonna take <clears throat> my hands to my chest and just give my neck and my chest a little bit of a skin stretching, pumping massage here. Don't go too hard, just stretch your skin, just kind of move the skin around. 
maybe swallow a couple times, maybe tuck the chin in a little so you lengthen your back of your spine. And then release the arms all the way up. And then exhale, interlace, and we're going to crunch up, place those indexes towards the feet, so reach them up. Inhale, lengthen, stretching up. Exhale, coming up. Breathe in. And out. Breathe in. And out. And then hands behind the head, lifting up. And then exhale, slowly lowering. And then stretch the arms both towards the left, left wrist grabbing for right wrist pulling up and over and then come to the other side Ooh, don't hit your plants and then coming back to center reaching the arms up and then exhale hands come down to heart center and then we're gonna start by moving the fluid that's in the upper trunk first. So we'll start by massaging underneath our armpits. So one at a time is fine if you have a sweater. So just pumping this area, really getting into the arm, but you can even relax your arm down. And then the other side. My hands are so cold. I feel like my patience gets even made and it's cold. And then coming to below the ribs, just gently doing some circular movements some pumping across the stomach. That fluid is going to come up and kind of over towards the armpit and then back to the heart. So kind of if you drew a line at your belly button, anything in the top quadrants are going to kind of come up. So kind of just almost raking them up towards the armpits. And anything below the belly button is going to drain down towards the hips into this air so you kind of push down and I'll push in and up because ultimately all this fluid is going to come back up through this channel so all this fluid all this fluid is kind of coming up and in <sighs> You can kind of play around doing the five to ten little pumps in each quadrant. And the pressure is really if you're just wanting to get the, the superficial and thighs, it's just a skin stretching like in the arm or in your bony prominence or the skin or the face. But the this abdominal region, you can do a little bit more pressure because the, most of the thighs and most of the lymph nodes, the, that thoracic duct is deeper. So you can you can go in a little bit, but if anything hurt, then then just don't do it. And then we'll do a little bit of intestinal massage just to help that lymph fluid move. So we're taking our hands to the right hip, to your right hip. Lift those arms up, fingertips up the, towards the right ribs, across, and then down that left side.
And then take a slow breath in. Exhale. And then bending the knees into the chest. Rock and roll side. And then let the hips fall to one side. Reach the gaze, the right arm to the right. And then bring those knees back in, other side. And then reaching the toes, reaching the arms, roll the wrists, roll the feet, reach up, and then bend the knees, rock side to side, and then slowly find yourself on one side, and then we'll meet in the seated position. Take your time getting there. Closing your eyes, bringing the palms together in heart center. Thank yourself for moving your muscles, moving your body in an intentional way, in a purposeful, caring, loving way, and for listening to yourself. And every day here on out, we'll get a little bit more aware and loving and thoughtful and appreciative of our bodies. So thank you for being here. Mm -hmm.